Oh my god, what? Wow. Wake up to a gunfight. What was the invite? Alright boys, I got this. Got one bullet left in this type rifle. So dirty. Damn on me. How many bullets you gotta take? Oh my god, shit, shit. All my ammo. Where's your weapons, jackass? Done looting? Can't see my gun. She <laughs> is thread dirty. Ooh, extend the mag. Uh, 
grab everything that I can, baby. Okay. Where's the big guy? Did I grab your stuff ready? Alright. That's it. That's it. Didn't we? Yes, we did. The thing is, their army is in a massive raid now. And this is just... The Baron sending his regards. How many of them are there? 700. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, we locked out here. And we'd better not overstay our welcome. We won't get far burning twigs. Five clicks at best. The dogs have fuel. Lots of it. A full tanker carriage on the rails. If we open gate quietly, we can steal it. They shouldn't have many guards now. Can you guide our men? I can. Let's get to business then. Yermak, Crest, you prepare the Aurora. Finish filling the boiler with water and drain the car's tanks. Arvin, Damir. You get the most important part. Stealing that tank. Yes, sir. Good luck, gentlemen. Anna, idiot, Tokarev, we're breaking <laughs> camp, people. Don't forget to check your gear and prepare before you set out. Maybe we could still negotiate with them. I tried that already. No dice. He takes women as payment. Artyom, we're fixing to leave already, but there's one thing that keeps nagging on me. Remember that dismantled ship I told you about? I can't stop thinking about the slaves they keep there. Do you think we could still free them? If not us, then who? <sighs> so tired of this dust. Can't wait to get out of here. Don't take dumb risks there. I need a live husband, not a dead hero. Okay, baby. Artyom, the car's near the Aurora. Yermak, you shoot the back to hold? Yeah, we'll have to run them through the whole carriage. They should. Our pumps aren't that good. Can't build much of a pressure, so I don't expect leaks. Some seepage at worst. But once we get far enough, we'll move the pipes to the roof and then replace them with proper metal ones. Hop in the car. Terry, what? Listen up, everyone. The Baron. Fuck off, dumbass. All right. Everyone in second reserve. Assemble at the ridge. Did I already free everyone at that place? Freed everyone at that broken ship already. I don't know what else you want me to do. We cleared that baby out. All right, we gotta go get some oil. These people have oil, and now they need freedom. car running on there's a question for you follow the gips It's 
so sandy. I'll see you. We're waiting for you. Come down and pan. Artyom, we took a look around. The main gate is guarded by a skeleton crew. You cannot go through gate. Go through the prison cellar where the Munai by Lair keep the slaves. Uh, <laughs> yes. In any case, the plan is this. Gul and I will try to take their guards down quietly and get in through the gate. If quiet does not work out, we will at least distract them, while you get in through the underground. Sounds good. <laughs> Let's go. We'll, we'll walk with you. Turn off the headlamp, man. Don't lag behind. You guys are basically fireflies. I have a favor to ask. If possible, don't kill the slaves. They're not... They just obey the Manai by Lair. Obey the Baron. They're afraid, that's all. Right. Deal. Money. Who is right about the locals? Here. This place. They're just kids, and all have been under brainwashing for ages. So we probably should take pity on them. So a great? Well, let's do this. Open it up, man. All right, I'll raise it, and you get through. Hercules over here. Go in. Hercules, Hercules. See you up there. Oh, nearly took an eye out. No use. Nobody go. Nobody fool. We stand here. All day here. You stop. No use. Nobody go. Nobody fool. We stand here. All day here. You suck. Better go hunt, find some food, make slave, more use that way. You said right, completely. Very right. Faster, fuck. You work or you go off the dog. <laughs> I don't understand. I can't knock this guy out. Whatsoever. <laughs> By other dog. Dog better than such Mirza. Such Mirza is dog himself. Thank you. 
This is like the most rundown place I've ever been. You guys are like literally in their own shit right now. God, this guy right there. Okay, I got it. Colonel, sir, Tamir here. We have secured the tank, but encountered uh, a problem with the gate. Copy that. We're going with plan B, then. Act accordingly. See, the cable connects the gate and the top of the tower. How do we get there, though? Oh, it looks like a veritable fortress. Gentlemen. Surely you're not seriously intending to attack our fortress. I do respect your courage, but simply throwing your lives away is such a waste. Who is in charge between you two? Come up here. We have things to discuss. Just you listen to that bastard talk. A complete about face. And we did throw a wretched into his plans big time. Point the gun down and come up. Otherwise, we'll have a pointless bloodbath on our hands. Open the gate and let our guests in! Where did you go? I am up on the tower already. I have a plan. Come on! We won't even touch you. Unless you really ask for it. Mm, I don't like this, but there is no other way. If we don't get out of this desert, we're as good as dead. Good luck, Artyom. If the deal goes south, I'll... Well, I'll do what I can. Get over here. Down. Go around, stinkers, and just get to the next floor. Anchors, slaves, even the boss straight stench. Why don't you fucking catch it from him? Our penthouse, that's the word. You must be one of the guys. You did the fucking look at the beauty of this blind of what? Well, you just fucking pulled it. Look at these guys. <laughs> what the hell are they pushing? Shut up. Can I get a drink? Look, you go up the ladder. Pass the headquarters, then pass the harem, and you'll end up right in the boss's door. What is if I just decide to shoot everything up? What would happen? Come to the boss here. Demonetization imminent. Want to see the boss? Come on in. Don't waste boss time here. Did you expect a different reception? <laughs> Here we 
can talk without the masks. I trust everyone present implicitly. You find it weird they're not really bothered by your little mischief. Well, you see, this world is a harsh and chaotic one. I'm just doing my best to introduce a little order into it. Without which there is no hope for something better in the future. But with no hope, you can't live. But let us cut to the chase. You definitely did not come here to enjoy the scenery. Ergo, you have a goal. And that goal is probably far from here. I respect people with their purpose in life. So, I am ready to provide you with fuel for your journey. I'm not asking for much in return. Surrender Gyor to me. Bring her to me, and we all win. I have you. You will have your fuel. Everyone gets to live long and prosper. Now. Fuel herself has come for you! You'll answer for everything! Oh baby, here we go. Wanted to build a Molotov, but that's not happening. I 
one in. Burn, bitch. Careful. At least the machine guy's down now. I've done a good ammo. Catch a bullet, you motherfucker! Oh shit! The mirror coming in hot. Look at the carnage. You went all out here, didn't you? They left me no choice. Couldn't help it. Whoa! Oh, impressive. So this is the plan Gule was talking about. What the hell is going on there? Get out of there! I'll send people to cover your retreat! Don't worry about it. We're okay. The door's giving. But let's give it a shove, Artyom! You wanted to create a new world with this? Not half of me. You're misguided at that time. Dog you! I got her. Take the baron. Oh, but. Who survives? So nonchalant. Gate open. Hooking the tank up. You gave my people hope. I'll never forget it. But this war has only started for me, and I must see it to the end. The winning end. Artyom, your dream led us here, but it won't help my people. This war is mine now, too. You're leaving? Or staying? Go, Artyom. Follow your dream. You're back, my love. I was so worried. Fanatics on the banks of Volga, cannibals in the mountain bunker, slavers on the shores of the dried out sea. How many monsters has the war given rise to? Or perhaps, were they always there? And the war simply gave them a chance to show themselves and now we're stuck with them forever. Will Damir, who stayed in the desert to help you lead their people to freedom, beat another monster? The inertia of thought that had been keeping the subjugated locals in willing and ready servitude to tyrants? Frankly, I have doubts. That monster might prove stronger than all the others. Regardless, we can't afford to lose hope. We're getting ever closer to our dream. Finding a place where we could live, free from radiation and mutants. The maps we recovered in the desert have provided us with several promising options. And now the crew members are excitedly waiting for the colonel's decision on where the Aurora should go next. Currently though, the train is calmly rolling eastward. The crew rests, and Stepan proposed to Katya. It was a proposal she couldn't refuse. Oh. 